Well, there's a lot of challenges ahead for agriculture. My daughters, their generation, are gonna have to produce more with less land and uh, probably less water, which is gonna be a huge issue in the future. Wireless has been a tremendous help to our farming operation because it's keeping me connected anywhere on the farm. Some of the farms that uh, I farm are kind of remote, so you may not see anybody for most of the day. Being able to be in touch with anybody whenever you need them is a godsend. LTE has impacted the business because uh, the transmission speeds, the data speeds are much faster and uh, we're able to incorporate those in the technology and our equipment to uh, make better decisions. The equipment that we use in the tractor for planning requires an iPad. That's how we record all our information and it's sent to the cloud. We can call up and, and see our varieties. Also, that lets us know if we're scouting to put fungicide applications. There's varieties that are more susceptible to disease. So all those decisions are just made a lot easier because we have access to that data. Well, all our fields are mapped. So we have a map that's on our iPads, on our computers, and my custom applicator has those. The helicopter application is very precise, so he doesn't have any overlap or spray in the areas that we don't want to spray. That not only lowers our cost, it's also good for the environment. It prevents uh, runoff and getting fertilizer in our streams. Each day, we're becoming more data-driven, and uh, without LTE, that wouldn't be possible. We're trying to keep relevant in an ever-changing world. So uh, the technology that we're embracing today is, is gonna have to increase. I wanna make it where my daughters are still able to farm.